Good evening. Where's the cameras? What? Well, you might have told me you changed the whole studio around. You know, I'm in a hurry. Yeah, and the same to you with bogeys wrapped round it. Uh, listen, good evening. My name's Kevin Turvey, and, uh, and I'm an investigative reporter and all that. But uh, and this week I've been investigating advice, right? Which is like another word for, uh, for help. Well, it's not really. Drowning, anyway. I mean, you don't swim there going, advice, advice! I mean, they just shout, swim, you granny! And then you drown, don't you? So it's no good, well, unless you want to drown. That's not important. The thing is, I haven't got time for my report, right? Because I just met this bloke outside in the bushes, right? I was just doing some investigating into leaves, you know, how come they grow on trees and what they taste like when you smoke them and things like that. Anyway, and he says, Psst, are you Richard Baker? I says, no, I'm Kevin Turvey. Which is like, true, you know. And he says, listen, can you give this... And he gave me this, guy. Right? He gave me this clock. He says, can you give this to Ian Trithowen? Yeah, Ian Trithowen, who's like the leader of the BBC. And he says, sir, uh, because he's got to have it any minute now. I don't know why. I think it's the play school clock or something like that. I said, can't you give it to him? He says, no, I can't. I've got a headache, you see. So I said, well, look, I've got to do a report in a minute. He said, it's more important than that. Give it to him now. You've got two and a half minutes, and now I've only got a minute. So listen, I'll tell you a story, right? Um, once upon a time, there's this uh, fish, right, who uh, lives in the bushes by the BBC, and uh, he meets this um, prince who's called Kevin. And... Uh, I've just been handed this note. Right, and, they, and he marries the prince, and, uh, and they have lots of babies. And the thing's packed in now. Work! Work, you bogey gobbler! Come on! It's not going to have to go to Watchmenders. Uh, so I'll, I'll leave you with this little joke, right? Uh, what do you say to a man who's got no arms and no legs if your watch is broken? Have you got the time on your cock?